we hope all of you are washing your hands and practicing social distancing to try and slow the spread of coronavirus. But the CDC guidelines also recommend for us to stop touching our face. That's because we do so so often and it increases the risk of infection. Your mouth, your eyes, all over your face, the virus can enter the body the easiest. But not touching the face sounds easier than it is. And you probably have already experienced this. According to one recent study, we touch our faces about 16 times per hour, okay? So even if you practice effective hand washing practices, touching our faces that much increases the odds of recontaminating our hands then. So all it takes, touching the wrong doorknob or a bad surface, and you are in danger again. But this is a habit that can be broken if we really truly dedicate some energy to it. A clinical psychology says be mindful about keeping your hands away from your face. Also keep your hands busy. Recommend it that you use a scented hand sanitizer as soap. That way when you go to put your hands up, you'll smell it and take them down. And also if you know you have a habit of touching your face, maybe wear gloves, that could be a good physical reminder. And Bruce, I heard this on a radio interview for kids. If you paint their faces, you know, like how you would at a carnival or something, then every time they touch their face, you see it, and then you can make that as a teaching moment. Hmm.